Our minds are powerful. Beyond thoughts and emotions lies a connection to the universe. We are part of a grand design. Our consciousness, a flicker in the cosmic dance, holds unimaginable power. It's a power to influence, to shape, to create. Think of your breath, the gentle rise and fall of your chest. This rhythm mirrors the universe's ebb and flow. It's in the stillness between breaths that we touch our true nature. This stillness is where the universe whispers its secrets. The universe speaks to us in silence. It speaks through the rustle of leaves, the crashing of waves, the gentle breeze on our skin. All we need to do is listen. When we quiet the mind, we can hear the universe's song. This song tells us we are not separate from the cosmos, but rather, we are the cosmos experiencing itself. Each one of us carries the universe within, a microcosm reflecting the macrocosm. The journey inward is the journey outward, a voyage of self-discovery and cosmic exploration. Quantum mechanics, a realm of science exploring the very fabric of reality, echoes these ancient truths. It suggests that reality is not fixed, but fluid. It's our observation that collapses possibilities into the concrete reality we experience. Consciousness, therefore, plays a crucial role. It's not merely a bystander in the universe, but an active participant. Our thoughts, our feelings, our beliefs all hold the power to influence the quantum field, shaping the reality we experience. Ancient spiritual traditions have long proclaimed this interconnectedness. The concept of karma, for instance, suggests that our actions, thoughts, and intentions create ripples in the universe. These ripples return to us, shaping our experiences. In essence, both quantum mechanics and ancient wisdom point towards the same profound truth. We are not merely observers of reality, we are creators. Our consciousness is the brush, and the universe is our canvas. Every thought, every emotion is a stroke of color contributing to the masterpiece of our lives. Consider the universe as a mirror. It reflects back to us what we hold within. If we are filled with love and joy, the world mirrors back love and joy. If we harbor anger or fear, the world reflects back conflict and struggle. This mirror doesn't judge, it simply reflects. It shows us with unwavering clarity the state of our inner world. Our external reality becomes a reflection of our internal landscape. When we understand this concept, we hold the key to transformation. We realize that changing our external circumstances starts with changing our inner world. By cultivating love, compassion and peace within, we begin to see those qualities reflected back to us in our everyday lives. This is not to say that life will suddenly become a utopian dream. Challenges will arise, but how we perceive and respond to them shifts. We move through life with greater awareness, understanding that each experience, whether perceived as positive or negative, holds an opportunity for growth and self-discovery. I once knew a woman named Maya, Plagued by self-doubt and insecurity, her life reflected this inner turmoil. Her relationships were strained, her career stagnant, and she felt lost and alone. One day, she embarked on a journey of self-discovery. She began to meditate, quieting her mind and turning her attention inward. She started practicing gratitude, focusing on the good in her life. Slowly, her inner world began to shift. As she nurtured self-love and acceptance, she noticed a change in her external reality. Her relationships improved, becoming more harmonious and fulfilling. New opportunities presented themselves in her career, leading her to a path she found both challenging and rewarding. Most importantly, she felt a sense of peace and contentment that had eluded her for years. Maya's story isn't unique. Countless individuals have experienced profound transformations by changing their inner world. It's a testament to the powerful connection between consciousness and reality. It reinforces the ancient wisdom that to change the world, we must first change ourselves. The power to shape your reality lies within you. It's not about wishful thinking or trying to control external circumstances. It's about cultivating a state of being, an inner alignment with the universe and its infinite possibilities. Start by becoming aware of your thoughts. Are they predominantly positive or negative? Are they filled with love and gratitude or fear and resentment? Remember, each thought is a seed planted in the garden of your mind. Choose your seeds wisely. 
Nurture your mind with practices that uplift and empower you. Meditation, mindfulness, spending time in nature, engaging in creative pursuits. These are all pathways to connect with your inner self and tap into the boundless potential that resides within. As you cultivate inner peace and harmony, you'll find that your external world begins to reflect this transformation. You'll attract more love, abundance, and joy into your life. You'll experience a greater sense of purpose and fulfillment, knowing that you are an active co-creator of your reality. The universe is not something separate from us. We are not merely insignificant beings adrift in a vast and indifferent cosmos. We are in essence the universe experiencing itself. Within each of us lies the power to shape our reality. Embrace the profound truth that your consciousness matters. Choose your thoughts and beliefs carefully, for they become the building blocks of your reality. Cultivate a heart filled with love, compassion, and gratitude. As you embark on this journey of inner transformation, remember that you are not alone. The universe is conspiring with you, supporting you every step of the way. Trust in the process and watch in awe as your inner world transforms, creating ripples of positive change that extend far beyond your own life. You are the architect of your reality. Build wisely and build with love. Until next time, keep questioning, keep dreaming, and keep exploring the boundless possibilities of the mind. Thank you for watching Philopop51. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe for more journeys into the mystical and philosophical realms. See you in our next adventure.